First two pieces of balsa are cut. Do our little spot repairs on our gel coat. Okay, we are back on the boat this morning. And last time we came in and filled all of the screw holes on the underside of our deck with epoxy, West Systems epoxy. And I think there was a total of nearly 40 of these little guys uh, from the front of the boat all the way to the back, just on one side. So we've still got the other side to do. What we are gonna do now is we're gonna come in and just clean the bottom of these epoxy patches uh, just with a Scotch-Brite pad and some warm water and then we're going to sand all along the bottom of here and get this prepped ready for our new core.
underneath the walkway is now all prepared. So we came in and washed away the aiming blush on the epoxy uh, holes that we'd filled and then gave those um, a little scrub with a scouring pad. And then we came in and sanded all along the bottom here and also got rid of all of the sort of residue from the rotten balsa on that back edge as well and cleaned up all the way down to the front. And then we also got rid of some of the adhesive blobs that were still on the hull uh, here as well. So that's all gone now. Uh, we came in and just covered up our port light with some um, protection film. And we also used a moisture meter just to check that the balsa core at the front was dry, which it was, it was lovely and dry, so that's absolutely fine. So what we're gonna do now is get some Corex, which is a corrugated clear plastic. And we're gonna use that to template this new core material that's gonna be put in down here. Okay, so we've cut our template guys. So we've got these ready to cut. Um, this is uh, a slightly thinner Corex actually that we ordered this time around and it's nowhere near as nice to use as the Corex that we used before. I think this was like a three or a four mil and this is a two mil and actually it's just too flexible. We've really struggled with this, but we've got our templates now so we'll get some balsa and get those cut out. First two pieces of balsa are cut, so they go just up here. So what we need to do is just put our little uh, patch of chop strand mat on there. So we'll just come in with a bit of acetone, clean that up, pop a patch on, and then we'll be able to get the balsa in place.
Alrighty guys, back on the boat this morning. So the weather's supposed to be pretty good today, 20 degrees and fair. So we're gonna come in and do our little spot repairs on our gel coat. So what we need to do is just come in with a grinder, just give them a little clean out again, bit of acetone, wipe them down, and then we'll be able to fill them with some gel coat and we'll mix that with some wax, just so that that gel coat can set up. And um, yeah, we've got about 40 of these little guys all the way down this walkway to sort out. So we've come in and just ground out all of these little holes along the deck and we've given them a clean um, or a wipe with acetone and we've also come in and ground this front edge here as well this was got some deep cracks in it and it was full of scratches and stuff so yeah ground all that out and again given that a wipe with acetone so what we're going to do is this part here we're going to use some thickened gel coat and we're going to try and build this back up again and then these smaller holes, we're just going to fill those with normal gel coat for mixed with wax just so that that sets up. So Rich is just mixing up a second batch of gel coat. The first batch was thickened, which we used on the back edge of the step. 
And then this batch is gonna be unthickened and we're gonna put that into some syringes to squirt into our little holes. With some 2% wax and styrene to make it set up nicely. Okay, so we've come in with a thickened gel coat and applied that on the back edge here. And then we've come in with the unthickened and filled these little holes using the syringe. And we've done that all the way down the side deck here. So we just need to leave that to set up now. Okay, so we've got our core material cut. So this is a composite material, it's a closed cell foam called Easy Cell 75. Um, and we're gonna use this instead of balsa because this is gonna be full replacement underneath the walkway. It's where we've had to dig out all of that rotten balsa. So we think actually it probably makes sense actually to go with the foam product there as opposed to the balsa, which where we've just been doing sort of small spot repairs. So this is the stuff we're going to go with on this piece and we're going to bond these into place with our easy fix. Okay guys, so our foam core is now in. So we've got the piece here at the front, we've got a piece here in the middle, and then a piece down here at the back, and then we've got these props just holding everything in place while the bonding paste sets up. And then next time we'll be able to come in and laminate under here and laminate this properly to the hull, and then that'll be a nice repair. It is the end of the day, so that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give us a thumbs up and we'll see you on the next one.